to my channel. Today I've got a very special guest with me. This is my twin brother John. John, will you say hi to everyone? <laughs> say hi. Hello. We're going to be making gingerbread cookies. It's going to be a competition between me and John who decorates the best ones. Obviously I'm going to win because I'm so talented. You got anything you want to say before we get started? Mm. Look at that smile. Right then, let's get cracking. As you can see, John's so excited to do this with me. <laughs> 60 grams of golden syrup. To a saucepan. Okay, we're gonna have to move this over there. We've moved over to the oven. Gonna put 60 grams of maple syrup in here. Do you want to pour it? I'm like, what? How the f do you measure 60 grams? 60 grams of maple syrup, it's a liquid. Panic over. Don't touch it. Oh my god, lick it now. Do you like it? Mm. No, he doesn't like it. Mm. How the hell do you answer 40 grams of butter? Have you got any wine cells? No. Have you got any wine cells? Okay, these measurements are stressing me out. No, stop, no! Here we have 40 grams of butter. Ready, John? We'll put it on a medium heat. You need to come back into it all. Anyway, guys, you all think that Katie, the other Katie, Glasses Katie, Katie Monument, was my twin sister. I actually have a twin brother instead of a twin sister. Who would have thought? Who's older, me or you? Mm. You know I'm not, it's you. Mm. By how many minutes? Mm. No. Oh. One, one. Alright, let's keep this a little mix up. <laughs> what are you doing? Just tiring you out. Right then, all the butter has melted. Now we're going to add the gingerbread mix. Sorry. No, you're not sorry. Sorry. I'm stirring it now, look. So it forms a dough for our gingerbread man. Oh, that sounds really nice. Do you like gingerbread men? Mm. Yeah. I hope so. Tell everyone, when's our birthday? No. November the 12th. 12. What year? Yeah, and how old are we now? 18. We're not 18. 13. 20. We're old, aren't we? We're big boys now. You are anyway. I can have a hug. Oh, barely. Right, we're letting that cool for five minutes. Five minute break. Over. What is it? Oh, like that. Oh god. There we go. Just looks like a pile of. John, what's that look like a pile of? <laughs> so sweet. I need until smooth. This doesn't seem right. Alright. What the heck was that supposed to be? The gingerbread. The panic is over. So it's a solid. Gingerbread thing now. I don't actually have a rolling pin, so this is the closest thing I could find to one. Do you want to do some rolling? Like that. Do you want to do it? Go on then, do you want to do it? Oh, good boy. You done this before? Mm. Singing? No. Do you dance? If you've ever watched any of my lives before, I've been discussing autism and like my experience of living my life around autism. John has autism, if you didn't know this, and his attention span is like this small, so this video is taking 12 times longer than it should. Don't rip that, do not rip that. Same. Yeah, good. Where's the, where's the rolling pin? Mm. Where have we put it? Ah, it's 
right here. It's right here. Just before I turn the camera on, he was eating the dough. <laughs> I wish I would have got that on record. I'm going to cut out the gingerbread pieces because June on dressing John with his knife, you must be crazy. Can you sing the new song? Mm. Ready? Jingle bells. Mm. John has. Mm. <laughs> Katie's. Mm. Oh! I'm hoping these go good. Now, how do we get it? Wait, wait, that's a question. Stop it. Oh my god, you joke. Do you not want to eat? No. You don't want to eat the gingerbread men? No. No fun. <laughs> oh god. See. Tell me what, it's took me 10 minutes to cut out one gingerbread man and then he's come over and ate off of it. How oh, perfect does he look? Don't you dare eat him. <laughs> Let's show the camera. Look at him! I hold this with Katie. You ready? Smile! Look at them! John, how many have we made? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight! We've made eight gingerbread men, and that is simply because Katie can't be bothered to cut anymore. This is left over, so I'm just going to let John snack on it, the little fatty. A snack! You like it? We actually have seven and a half gingerbread men because John ate one of their arms. Okay, we've only got like 12 minutes and then we can get on to decorating! Um, five. John is more excited about our new doorbell than he is about doing this video. John, it's your debut, you should be out there. Say, be right back. Be right back. And, come here. What do we tell the haters? Oh, Up yours! I mean, I've got to be credited for teaching him that anyway. While there's a baking, I need to, I need to show you what I Go Vogue treated me to for Christmas. I Go Vogue specialise in customised trainers. Let's see what bad boys I got. <laughs> These are hard. Look at them. They are blue gradient going into green drips. And then they've got Rick and Morty on them. These are sick. I love them. They do different types of shoes. These ones look like Jordans. They do ones that look like Air Forces, like Converse. They can literally do any design you want. The customer service is excellent. They won't start making the shoe until you're fully happy with your design, the shoe, everything. And then they'll get to work. These are amazing. I cannot wait to show them off in the new year. I'd like to say thank you very much, I Go Vogue. And make sure you check them out for people's birthdays and stuff because they're too sick. But I saw so many different designs on the website. They've done like Travis Scott one. They can do anything. They'll literally cater to all you need. So make sure you check them out because I would highly recommend. And they're also comfy as <laughs> I <laughs> John. <laughs> they're a bit burned, aren't they? My but oh! I might have burnt some of them, but get over it, okay? Oh shit! Oh shit! I burnt all of them. You're all burnt! <laughs> Looks like we won't be eating. <coughs> Is that funny, dear? Shall we decorate them anyway? I am gonna copy this design and oh. so I think that's so good. Sneeze. Sneeze? Did pumpkin sneeze? Mm. Are you gonna decorate this one? How do you wanna decorate it? Gonna put a smiley face on it, maybe a scarf. For the face, maybe. <laughs> oh, brilliant. What about this one? I'm going to put this one on it. Squeezing really hard, really hard squeezing. Or eat it, you know, whatever. That's really creative, John. You should be proud of that. John's final masterpiece. <laughs> Bless him. It's a thought that counts. I think he actually hates doing this, he's just doing it to please his little sister. 
Clearly, this video is a big fat file. I burnt the gingerbread men. Some of them are disabled. Brilliant. <laughs> well, I'm going to show you a special handshake. Ready? Fast! Ready? Slow. You say it, what should we do? Fast. Fast. Well, they really, 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 really fast. Big ya, ready? Right, have you had fun with Katie today? One more. One more. Yes. Have you had fun being in Katie's video today? <laughs> mm. Do you want to eat one of the gingerbread men? Mm. No, they're too hard, you can't even eat them. Listen to this. with me if you would like more appearances from the man himself mm -hmm. comment down below mm -hmm. and I hope you liked his debut <laughs> even though he hasn't been in it much because he's running off if you've got any questions about autism or anything let me know maybe we can do another video answering all your inquiries or whatnot whoa leave that alone hug to finish mm -hmm. leg 